Hello, this is Athena with AMG Creates, and this is week 19's plan with me. The first official full week of May. That was last week's. Um, I really enjoyed how cute that it looked. And I will be using Kangarific and the Kangarific add-on. Uh, the 13th, or the, well, the 12th, which is Sunday, is Mother's Day, so I figured that this would be a great stamp set. Um, yeah, so I'm basically going to make some sand, and it, it's essentially just me speed coloring it in. Um, this week is awesome, for me at least, um, because I will be starting, I guess, the next the next chapter of, of what I would like to do, what I want to be when I grow up, maybe, hopefully. God, I'm 36. I need to figure something out, you know? Um, so I have, will have enough money saved up to start taking online classes for medical billing and coding. Um, which is something that I actually wanted to do back whenever I was in college, but kind of got scared away from it <clears throat> because, um, it was mostly geared towards nurses. So people that wanted to get into nursing and we were told that your your notes could be handwritten they could be voice um if you've been around doctors lately uh I, it sounds horrible but it is sometimes really hard to understand them and um I have been around people that when writing really quick, and I do too, and I'm left-handed, so that makes it worse. But when writing really quickly, you don't know what they're, what they wrote. You have no idea. Um, and who's gonna go back and be like, "Hey, I realize you're a surgeon, but um, you need to write better." I don't know what this word is. And then they're gonna blame me, and that uh, nope. So I got scared of it really quickly. I got scared off of it. Um. So I did things like phlebotomy and stuff like that instead. Uh, so I do know how to draw blood. Um, yeah. <laughs> and that was 10 years ago? Maybe a little bit more? Um, considering that I've been out of high school for 20 years, but we're not going to talk about that. Well, next, next year is 20 years. Not that that helps at all. But anyway, um, yeah, I... Uh, I wanted to go into it and even the, um, so the medical terminology, uh, was a, a half course, which was ridiculous. So I had, um, I tried going through it and I passed, I think, I can't remember, but it was like having to remember all this stuff in half the time that you should. And I had full courses, so it was it was a whole full day of classes, and there was no way, absolutely not. Um, so yeah, uh, with medical billing and coding, you you don't need to memorize stuff that quickly. Granted that yes, it's going to you know. The more that you know it, the more you don't have to look it up, the easier that it is. Um, but yeah, I already bought a, what is this, um, a medical terminology and anatomy for coding. It's the fourth edition. The fifth edition comes out in October. Um, there are books that, of course, I'm going to have to keep buying every year because if one little thing changes, then I'm you know, you have to stay updated. So the class that I'm taking actually like includes the books and everything, which is great. I'm just really excited about it. Um, you also, you have to keep learning, um, in order to keep, you know, up to date and everything you have to keep learning. Well, that's also something that I enjoy doing, but every time that I look to see how much classes are for something or even like free things it's just like I can look something up on YouTube and stuff like that um, 
and it's it's just so nice to learn stuff so the other thing is is that I've seen a lot of YouTube videos where people have come on with no experience and that that scares me um, <laughs> but I want the certificate and it also comes with an externship which means that it's unfortunately free um, but it's the experience which is cool because I'm working at a place where hopefully the externship is remote because if you're not gonna pay me um, with with anything but experience then uh, it's gonna be really hard to do because experience don't pay the bills not that I really pay bills my I mean my husband pays most of them all obviously but I've got my own stuff too you know um, it's it's not it definitely not a 50 50 put it in kind of thing but if I do this and get good at it and the experience then it could be which is awesome um, I'm definitely one of those women who like, uh, I like having my own money. I like spending, you know, I, I like, <laughs> I like being slightly independent. So, and, um, if it's a work from home job, then I've been flirting with the whole thing of getting a dog again. That way I can be home and I can teach it, which means that while I'm working, uh, the dog will be in a crate. Um, might be in a crate in here next to me, but will be in a crate. Maybe. We'll see. My mom's listening to this. She's shaking her head. Yeah. Um, so yeah, we'll see how it goes. I'm really excited that this is... It's something I've wanted to do for a while. Um, that I'm, I'm just getting back to... I've seen the test for this and it is an elimination test like you have A, B, C, D and you're allowed to bring in your books as long as you haven't scuffed them up too bad. So if you write in any extra notes, things like that, um, then of course it's not going to work out too well. But um, yeah, you're allowed to bring in your books, which is awesome. And it's all, it's remote, so I would probably have to do it in the kitchen, which means that my husband and the monster will have to leave for four hours while I get this done. Which will be cool, because then, you know, they'll be doing stuff together. Um, so yeah, that's, that's the idea. Uh, it is a around four to six month course and you get to keep it for a year so four to six months with the thought of having it for a year which is awesome um so even if life throws a horrible wrench you know your way then you have a whole year um i hope to be done before then but yeah um, anyway, back to the planner. I am, um, throwing in some Chrissy and Design stuff because it's, it's pink. It reminds me of Mother's Day stuff, I guess. Um, and it also helps me to use them because I know that while, while, you know, Kristen is very happy that we support her, she is also very happy to see how they get used. <laughs> um, so, I didn't have another little one for Friday. Eh. So yeah, I'm using a big one that's going to get covered up. Um, so anyway, if you guys like what you're seeing, uh, please make sure to thumbs up. Um, the kangaroos down at the bottom and everything are going to be used for cards for the next uh, Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. So easy card, medium card, card I'm never going to want to do again. Um, yeah. And if you want to see stuff like that, please feel free to subscribe. Um, if you like what you see on here with the plan with me, then please feel free to leave a thumbs up or a thumbs down, whatever. In fact, comment. Tell me why you don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> but this is it for this plan with me um, I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you again next Monday with another plan with me
Bye.